Hi, it's Michelle Eaton here from Local Business Web School. Today um, I'm just going to come into my dashboard and I can see that I've got a few updates. At the top here it's telling us that WordPress itself has got a new version available. And on the left we can see the total updates is 8 and we've got plugins, 3 of which need to be updated. Now make sure you've backed up your WordPress site before you do any updates. So we'll start with the main WordPress update. We'll click the link here that says please update now. And there it's reminding us please back up your database and files. And we're going to click update now. And then WordPress is telling us about all the new features included with the new update. If we scroll down to the bottom we can say return to dashboard updates. Click on that and here you can see it's telling us we've got the latest version of WordPress and we've got some plugins here that need to be updated. So we select all of those and update. Now those have been updated. Let's come back up to updates at the top left and see what updates we've got left. That's some themes that we can update. Well, we're only we're only using the Weaver two, so we'll select that and we'll update that theme. We could update them all, but not necessary really. So Weaver two is updated. Okay, and that's just shown us the details. So we'll come back to the dashboard. As we can see on the left now in the updates, we've got no updates left. So that's it for updates. Fairly simple, but very important to do that backup beforehand in case you have any problems following any updates. So I'll speak to you soon.